Challenging problems need creative solutions and Kinetic has the people who know how to find these solutions. What you are about to see is just one example of this, allowing a client to demonstrate an advanced new weapon system within the UK. Attack by Fast Inshore Attack Craft, or FIAX, is a growing threat to naval ships and dockyard facilities around the world. The use of well-coordinated attacks that deploy these small, high-speed vessels is rising along with a diversity of possible aggressors. So, the development of new defensive technologies designed to mitigate this threat must keep pace. MBDA is a complex weapons manufacturer in the process of developing a surface-launched weapon that is capable of intercepting a group of FIACs. As part of the development program, MBDA planned a live demonstration within a realistic scenario to a specially invited audience of potential clients. This demonstration represented a significant milestone in the development of an anti-fiat capability. MBDA trusts Kinetic to deliver on uh, their side so that we can concentrate on uh, looking at the weapon performance. Kinetic is a long-term partner of the Ministry of Defence and operate and manage their UK weapons test and evaluation ranges under the Long-Term Partnering Agreement, or the LTPA. We have both the facilities and the know-how to accommodate such demonstrations on behalf of the British Government and other clients. Kinetic is a company that can sort out customers' problems. It's not necessarily about products, it's about using the right technology or the right solution to come up with an answer to a customer's problem. Clients come to us because of our ability to overcome challenges which at first glance just seem impossible. And, uh, and this project was no exception. Right from the outset there were some significant hurdles that we had to clear. The first challenge was to find a suitable location a coastal launch site with a large enough uninhabited area to safely conduct the test. Particularly important to our client, this demonstration was conducted in the UK for a number of reasons. Because going overseas would have had some significant logistical and cost implications, but probably most important of all would have been the security and confidentiality problems that would have arisen. After extensive research and discussions with MBDA and our specialist suppliers, we developed a plan that involved launching the weapon from a temporary platform moored out to sea. The site that we chose was MOD West Frew in southwest Scotland. This was previously an RAF bombing range that now forms part of the MOD's test and evaluation sites that are operated and managed by Kinetic under the long-term partnering agreement. So we've got a pretty good understanding of the site and its locality. I've been here for over 31 years undertaking trials, so I've built up an extensive domain knowledge of the area. Safety is our number one priority. Loose Bay has around 380 square kilometres of a sea danger area, so we are able to move all shipping out of the area if required. A suitable base platform was sourced and was towed the 750 miles from its location in Rotterdam to Barrow in Furness for extensive modifications. Splinter-proof buildings to house all personnel and their equipment were installed, ensuring the safety of anyone close to the launch site. It was then towed the remaining 70 miles to its final destination in the middle of Loose Bay. Once the platform arrived at West Frew, it was positioned and then planted on the seabed. It then received modifications for stability and a launch rail was installed. The safety trace associated with this particular weapon takes up most of Loose Bay and therefore it was critical that we positioned the launch platform such that the safety trace remained within the range danger area. With the platform in place, suitable targets were needed. The full static boats have been modified uh, from their initial rollers, uh, harbour working boats, into boats that are representative of a uh, FIAC target. The remote target is a 13 metre aluminium hull speedboat. The safety of the trial is paramount. As part of the preparations for the trial, we've had to develop a remote control e-stop system that allows us to stop the boat safely and reliably and consistently. Prior to the demonstration, a proof of concept firing was conducted, with the explosive payload being replaced with telemetry instrumentation. The data was checked and any necessary adjustments were made. Following the successful firing, our environmental team was deployed to recover the sunken target craft and any debris. A particular challenge for both the proof of concept firing and for the demonstration was to transport live weapons from the West Frew Munitions Store 
to the platform. There's no dock in the area with a munitions license, so to get the weapon actually onto the platform caused us a bit of a headache. We have an amphibious rib, which we can crane the weapon into a cage on the back, drive it physically down the beach, into the sea, across the 11 kilometers of the platform, and the weapon can then be craned up and loaded onto the platform. On the day of the demonstration, last minute preparations were made, including final weather checks to ensure safe operating conditions and surveillance established to confirm that the danger area remained clear of all shipping. Powerful long range tracking cameras along the shore were used to observe and record how the missiles performed, along with cameras situated on the platform and the target craft. Three excellent impacts on three targets. The, the data was good. We've got great video footage of the impacts. We've got great tracking data. Extremely happy. The thing that impressed me was the way that MBDA and Kinetic both managed to overcome a number of major challenges and still achieve the successful result on time for the customer. By bringing together expertise and equipment from right across the UK, we enabled a customer demonstration to be undertaken safely and successfully. For innovative solutions to challenging problems, Kinetic has the people who know how.